so we back with a new day, new video. So right now we are going away to uh Martin the Trick Car Meet. We haven't been to you know a lot of car meets, so I want to bring the car out and go to like more car meets. <laughs> Yo, oh shit! <laughs> Yo, hey what? <laughs> To get to the car meet, we didn't even get to the car meet yet. Which is a uh, oh, a nice super. I like them supers. Rest in peace to my guy Paul Walker, man. So we just pulled up to the car meet. We got a cat out here. We got Ty out here. It's the life of a Mopar. You can't even leave your car nowhere. But uh, shit, you got a cat, man. You got a good old SS. Is this SS or okay? We got C8. It's, we got C8 outside. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's stock, stock. Okay. <laughs> we got some cars outside, man. We outside, another super. We out here, man. Come on, man. <laughs> bro, chill, bro. So y'all, well, this is how we gotta leave the car blocked all the way in. Run, man. Run, man. <laughs> y'all, we at the meet. We in this little parking lot, but it really ain't nothing going on too, too much. We got like a couple Audis, uh, CTS right there, uh, Infinities, couple Vets. I like, it ain't nothing like really, really crazy out here. At least not in this parking lot, but hey, where else full, so. I don't know. Check this out. We got an SS right here. I don't know what this car is. We got a C8 Stingray with the motor. This look good. I ain't gonna lie. I had to come talk to him. Yeah. Wow. You put mine to shame. How long you had it for? I picked it up in January. I was on the list for about a year. Okay. Uh huh. Yeah. I like it. anything done to the exhaust? Mm -hmm. Stock exhaust? Stock exhaust. Yeah. That's hard. I want to put an exhaust on it, but I like my black. Yeah. Then we got this big old lifted truck. I know I got a lot of y'all watching the channel that drive like lifted trucks, and I ain't gonna lie, this purple is hard. That purple look crazy. You got like the whole underbody of the car spray, big old exhaust tip. This thing said hot. I can't lie to y'all. We got a few vets out here. You got a, a, a Pontiac Firebird, I believe. I ain't too sure. Uh. Camo Vet. Damn, that boy sounds crazy. Man, that sounds good, man. Camo, Camo Vet. That boy sounds crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Nothing Vet. Z06 for y'all Vet boys. Y'all, y'all, y'all Chevy boys. He hate on every, on every Mopar, bro. Look at the roof, bro. No, the rim's definitely bad, though. How much is this car? I don't know. If it's a 60, 70 feet. You might as well just get a swap at that point. They could at least put, like... They could at least put a cat on it. They could have put... You know what? They, they got the Hellcat seats on there, though. I think they're going to put a cat in one soon. But it was it only made sense to drop a Scat Pack version in the Hellcat. They could have definitely came five spokes, though. I'm not going to lie. Got the red Brimbos, though. But I don't know. What if I was to get one of these, y'all? I definitely would not. I, I like the charger. I'm a charger guy. That's why I went from the 300 to a charger. Oh, this, this mug sounds crazy. Whoa, we got the, I know this ain't the, the, the four boys. I know this ain't the four boys going crazy. No, this boy sound wild. I can't lie to y'all. 
You got a pet out there, man. It's definitely some cars out here, man. Definitely some whips out here. Got the OG Nissan out here, man. 392 Rubicon. G. What, what you see over here, man? Audi. We're going to look at these crazy Mopar autos, of course. Why yeah. do you have a water for your supercharger? Bro, why would you not? It's Mopar stuff. Bro. This is a real motor, not none of that LT4, LT1, you know what I'm saying? None of that. Hey, don't, don't act like no trader, like you didn't just have a Mopar. Pick a side, bro. Pick a side, pick a side, you know. Pick a side, man. Now we got some guys that ride bikes on the channel, so here got some bikes on, you know what this is. It's a BMW Habusa. That's like down to the fastest bike in the world, I believe. Yamaha, I don't know what this is. Oh, that's a Honda right A CBR Honda. And that is R1. So is that R1000s? Uh, no, the or, R1000s and Suzuki bitches, I think. Okay, yeah, yeah I, I'm, I'm kind of lost in the bike world. All I know is about the Habusas. For real. This, I heard like the fastest bike down there. Do you remember when Detroit said they're spending 30 million? On oh, speeding uh, cameras, speeding yeah, cameras, right? And it's getting paid by the state, right? Right. Michigan. Oh. Why is there a seat hole in the middle of the parking lot? <laughs> bro, one of these guys on these bikes hit that, they flipping off definitely. That bitch gonna step near That bitch gonna go to eternity. Damn. Damn. Bro, stick, stick your hand in there. You sound crazy. Stick your What's hand up, in there, bro. Somebody, somebody gonna pull me down. <laughs> Hell yeah. Wild body cat. Man. That, that's horsepower right there. That's horse. That's horsepower right there. You about to get hit by a bike, Chevy owners. Man, you got a vet out here. Yeah, you got a lot of vets out here. I ain't gonna lie to you, vet. Let me find out the vet's taking over, man. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. This car we do got a bigger turnout than I thought it was gonna have. I ain't gonna say. You got. <laughs> Can y'all tell Ty to come back to YouTube? Like, like, Ty, no, bro. Come here, bro. What did you tell me? You tell me Friday? So, what's today? Today is Wednesday. This video probably gonna go, like, go out like Friday or Saturday. So, when they gonna get a video? You gonna record Friday, when they gonna get a video, Ty? Tell them how you come, you get more time. Tell them how you come. He said maybe video Saturday. He got till Tuesday of next week. Hey, hey, get your phone out. Let's see the date, let's see, let's see the dates. Go to the calendar. What's today? Ty, look at him. No, don't run, bro. What's today? Right now, yeah. 19th. He got to what? The 24th or the 25th to do a video. You got to next Tuesday, bro. Okay, we got a. I think this is a. Is this an RTR? No, it's a 5 but It was an RTR I heard earlier. Then we got a Shelby, Coyote, BMW M3. Uh, this BMW look kind of hard, though. Like all the black on black. I feel like the seats could be better because the seats kind of like plain, but I don't know. I mean, you ain't doing the BMW. Fuck with it. Nah, I feel like the seats kind of ass in here, bro. Like low key. Yeah, no big niggas, man. No, we hell no. We can't get in this bitch. <laughs> like little flat bottom carbon fiber with steering wheel. That's I see tough. that. Yeah, that's, tough. that's tough. I like how I got like damn near like the Lamborghini cup holder yeah, for the yeah. passenger. Yeah. That's hard. <laughs> Nobody back. Chill out, bro. Me? Oh my god. I do terrible texting. Oh my god. What's the who you out here with? I came with this guy. Oh yeah. They got a fing Slurpee. Uh Subaru out here. They got a McLaren 750S. And we got the McL other McLaren out here. Like they got the cars out here, man. I ain't gonna lie. I got a Shelby drop top. This is McLaren hard, man. A few minutes later. Hey, y'all know, it ain't gonna never be a car meet that the police don't come to. Bro. I, shit, man. I tell y'all, y'all stop, man. Shit. They don't want the boy to be outside enjoying life, having fun, man. I 
I tell y'all, they got all that over there blocked off. Like all this is blocked off. No cap. Look at him. The minivan got damn underglow. Where are you going, bro? Like, what? Whoa, what? Damn. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I don't come out the car because somebody I guess just got shot. Like, that's crazy. Y'all, so we got DT here. We got a lot of police. Said somebody got shot, but oh. So what did that? The car crash? Whoa. Damn. So check this out. You own a Chevy. Come here. Explain to me what one of your Chevrolet brothers did. He was the previous Mustang owner. Yeah. And when the diff locked, he couldn't do nothing. He wasn't used to it. You know what I'm saying? Mustang's over there. So you take an L, you drive a Chevy, right? I am sick off that too. Damn, you know what I'm saying? That's a fairly nice one. But where he said that he bumped it. No, what happened? I guess the guy in the event barely hit the guy that was on a bike, so. The next day. Alrighty, now what would be a day without having to get gas? Don't worry about that down there, but y'all see me at Sam's Club, because look at this. We got 12.3 miles per gallon. Fuel range is low, man. We got the big SRT starving for gas, but uh, right now we are going to put this new mod on, so. I can't show y'all the front because I got my address and, you know, some of y'all just be weird. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, we're going to get some gas. Uh, I think we're going to hit Panda Express over there and grab something for lunch. It is like, well, it's pretty much dinner time. And then we are going to get the pack of punch performance on the screen. Anybody that y'all see me work with, just know they fire. I'm not going to nobody that I don't know who do good work. Because why would I send y'all to somewhere if they ain't doing good work or not, you know? So, this is a phone video, so that's why the quality is probably going to look so much better than the camera. And, uh, yeah, so this is going to be like 4K, 60 frames per second, I believe. And let me know if y'all like the phone. I know y'all like the phone because it's like wider angle and stuff like that. Until we get a wide angle for the camera. So until then, we are going to be trapping off the phone. But we're going to get a wide angle lens very, very, very soon. So the tail light tint that we got is crazy. Is that a cat? Hold on. I see five spokes. I don't know if that's a cat or not. But yeah, he got like a nice little Mopar behind us. He got the, he got all his windows tinted. Shit. We need to get tent. We need a minimum off the leak. We got so much stuff to freaking do. Not even to mention the car literally need brakes. I haven't even had this car for two months and we need to get brakes. So we're going to get some brakes. I believe this week, so that's probably gonna be in the next video. So I gotta get the car ready to go out of town. So, this y'all 389 and the gas burns slow. Like, you can't beat that. Like, I promise y'all, not tell you, y'all can't beat this. Literally, like, y'all can't. Come on now. Actually, yeah, he been live in the flesh. Let's get it going. Deesh. Oh, let's see what it took, man. We're gonna pull this on out of here. Make sure we ain't dripping none on a pitch black. 392 almost said scat man but let's see what it took $63 you know that ain't too bad you know it's a good day uh, y'all check this out if y'all haven't seen the last video go watch that video after this video but we had uh hit the wall on 94 going west so we are going to be like approaching where I crashed so if you haven't watched the last video I'm gonna go through this real quick it was a little rainstorm I got off the freeway Made a bad decision, got back on the freeway because the rain like stopped uh, being so hard. I was in the middle lane and the car just out of nowhere went right. I spun around, my passenger was on like that side of the median. We're gonna like drive past where it was at. It's a few miles down, but like the whole time I was coming through here, it just kind of felt sketchy. Like I just made a bad decision to get back on the car, but luckily the car was pretty cool. By me hitting the wall, it didn't hit the car. Like the car didn't get messed up, but I just hit the rim. So when I seen I couldn't stop myself from hitting the wall and I was gonna hit the wall regardless, I locked the wheel up to the left. And by the grace of God, what I thought about that freaking fast worked. So I was like in my head, boom, we will hit the wall. I don't wanna hit the body. I want to hit a rim. So I locked the wheel to the left, wheel locked up and the, the rim bounced off the wall, thank freaking god man so 
I, I, that's a blessing. I'm, I'm blessed to still have my car. Nothing was wrong with it, but um, I need a wheel liner, my adapt, uh, cruise control, and so, no, this car got active suspension. So that's kind of messing up, which is just a part I got to get ordered and then a tire rod. Besides that, everything else was good. The car got a little war wound that I showed y'all in the last video. I'm not going to show y'all in this video. So around this area, you know where I'm at. This is like eight mile inverter exit. And it's just like the whole time right here, I'm just going like 35 and a 55, just cruising. I just knew better. Like I'm just knowing, I'm feeling the car come from up under me a little bit, but whole time just sticking it through. I'm just trying to stick it through to get to my exits. I didn't have too far to go. Y'all, we pulling up. This was the exit I had got up off of. So uh, it's a little bit more down. We're gonna be about to pull up to the spot. So mind y'all, I'm in this middle lane right here where the pink Camaro is. I'm gonna try to get like the exact spot kind of where I was at, cause right before the exit. So I think I was like right here. Uh, no, not right there. This is a Barbie Camaro. But uh, no, nah, what the hell? But let me see. I was, let me see, maybe like right there. I was like right around here, boom. Went, car was going straight, boom, went to right. Spun me around. I parked on the shoulder, looked at the car for a second, and went up the little uh, exit. That's literally what happened. At uh, a lot of people say, if you go past like where you had a car accident, at, you had PTSD. But I rode past them just fine, just because I don't think I had any like real trauma or anything like that. I'm just glad that everything played out the way it played out and not a different way. So yeah, we're gonna keep on cruising until we hit Pack a Punch Performance House. Then we'll see y'all in a second. I believe Ty is over there getting some work done on um his dad car, I'm not sure. And then we're gonna put the tail light tent on this car. And then uh yeah, look at these guys with 94. Even though we crash again, bro. A few minutes later. They already back there getting started. Design looks so crazy. Now it's a lot of designs for these cars for tail lights, but a lot of people already got a lot of the same design. So I want to be different. I got something that looked like it was like shark teeth. So we're gonna pop back here and just show y'all real quick. The car dirty though, I'm not gonna lie to you. Ty, you know what somebody said in, in, in the comments of the last video? Yeah. It said peanut butter seats for the, what'd they say? Peanut butter guts for the sluts. Is that fire? <laughs> Look how dirty this car is. Can y'all tell him to please open up a detailing service? Oh y'all check this out, it's been probably like 20 minutes or so. So he pretty much got the whole top done up across here. And then down here. Now it look a little weird because it's daylight, but I'm sure once it get dark outside and the sun starts setting, it's gonna look like way better. What you think, Ty? You think it's gonna look hard? Yeah, it's gonna be different. I ain't never seen it. Like yeah, that's why I hopped on. It's like it's so many of the same exact designs. I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to be like everybody else. I've only for real seen this one one time, and it was an out of state car. Yeah, I never seen the white had this inside the city. Look, he like it already though. I just feel like once it get really dark, it's gonna look crazy. So I just had to turn and run the lights on so we can see what it look like. They said you said it look hard, right? Yeah. What you think, Ty? Let me see. Nah, that is looky hard, bro. No, it came out like perfect too. That's why y'all should go down there. Link inside the description. Go give my boy a follow, Pack Punch Performance. Y'all need anything done to your car, performance wise, customized wise, you know what I'm saying? Chrome delete, everything. Go give my boy a follow. It's gonna be on the screen right there too. First link inside the description. I'm gonna make it easy for y'all. He worked with me, I'm working. Check this out, y'all. We've been at the Telegraph Cruise for a little minute now. The, the, the big ass RT, I almost said 300. The big ass RT been on chill. It's getting kind of dark out here, so I wanted y'all to see how the tail lights look. This shit look foul, bro. That look crazy. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I didn't expect for it to look that crazy. Like, wait till it get a little bit darker out here. And I'm gonna really show y'all how crazy it look like. That's hard. Like, like I said, I've never seen too many scat packs, SRTs, or any charges with that design. Like, that look crazy. But we just turned it off, and yeah. But so far, it's a nice little crowd here. I don't think I record nothing, but we at the little, you know, Home Depot parking lot. Y'all know the police is so famous for coming outside, ruining people's time and stuff like that. The next day. Man, this is crazy. 
freaking low tire light is definitely on. We are running on a tire with low freaking air. And of course, it will start raining again when I'm four minutes away from the tire shop. The PSI has dropped to 21. It just was at 22. PTSD is kicking my ass. And now we at 19 PSI, but this is our exit right here. Now I've been to the tire shop before a long time ago. I believe it's up here to the right. It's saying like no pay promo or nothing like that. Your boy just, you know, trying to get his car fixed. And these are the guys that I came to do it. It's other places, but they was acting weird, like saying they don't know if they could do it or not. Like, what do you mean? Can you not put a tire on the roof or what? Man, but I can pretty much say we have made it, honestly. So, oh, this is crazy. What is this, five, seven? Man. Yeah, nice little Hemi. So, this is it right here. God, man. This is crazy, man. Flat tire. Freaking, uh, not even no run flats. Flat tire, ball tire. Crazy, man. So, it should be right up here on the left. G8. Okay, okay, G8. You finna get ran over. Like, what's up with you, foe, now? Nigga, young as hell, your mama at. Here we go. We're going to back over in. Damn, boy, you slap him. So I get here, and he say follow him to the other shop, bro. Now I'm on 17 PSI. I went from 19 to 17. We just lost two PSIs, man. Like, what they on, man? Damn. Then I'm saying, like, can I get some air? Tire compression not working. Like, crazy as hell. Like, I don't know what Michigan got going on right now. Got the little air pump, but it's going to take a little while. So if it get too low, we got to just pull over. We got to just wait on me or something, man. This, this is crazy. And now we have 11 PSI, and we just made it here off liver noise, I guess. And I guess the whole tire shop was just closed down, but he got to reopen it. And we got to get the tires put on. Y'all see that's one tire right there. And then we got the other one back there in the trunk. Y'all ain't going to be able to see it because the seats or whatever, however that go. But oh, dude, this, this shit right here is frustrating me, man. It's starting to rain out, man. Ball tires once again. But we're going to have some fresh brand new ones on the car. I don't even know how good y'all can hear that. But listen. No, I'm just recording. With the, man, look at that. Tire is cooked. But yeah, we just made it here. It got a little bit of rain coming down, but yeah, it's crazy, bro. Like driving in this predicament is wild. Damn, some wire showing right there. Damn, them got cut. This one for sure. This one ain't as bad. Oh, it, it is for sure. Yeah, make sure we got no cracks, nothing like that. But you could just hear it. Like these boys is like, boy, oh, look at that. Ain't even nothing right there. Shit, but we got the two brand new 275 4020s right there getting ready to go on the car, man. Just like that, we got the first one getting mounted up already. It's already mounted, just getting air put in the tire. Boom, put that back on the car. We good. Do the other one. Boom, we out of here, man. So basically, I ain't gonna, you know what I'm saying, do too much, but I had to pay him to stay open. I had to pay him to open it back up, you know what I'm saying? So. Uh, this is that that money do man I, I can't have my car sitting for too long man I, it's my daily for right now you know man this michigan weather is so crazy it is literally pouring and raining but it is a new day i'm sorry but i just been going through a lot you know what i'm saying trying to get myself together i've been working and then like my car was down because y'all see that i had to get new tires and this and that so it is all thunderstorming and raining so it is like very, very, very bad outside. Like, this is kind of crazy, y'all don't know. The last video, I believe it was the last video we crashed in the rain or something like that, I believe so. But PTSD is kind of kicking in a little bit. It's just looking so crazy on here. Look at this, y'all. But right now, like, this is how I dedicated. I have uploaded like five days. Y'all supposed to get this video today. But man, life just goes on. But uh, we have to go all the way to um, Best Buy in Roseville because for some reason, I tried to finish editing the video last night for y'all to give it to y'all today. And the freaking MacBook charger went out. I leave a plug into the wall. I know that's not smart. 
But yeah, so the charger went off. We gotta get a brand new charger. I already ordered it. It's, it's ready for me to come pick it up. So I did it like that so I can know they got it. And I won't be going through this little rainstorm for no reason. It is thundering, you know what I'm saying? So it definitely is getting very wicked out here. I'm gonna tune back in with y'all in a second. Then we're gonna end the video off real, real slow. I don't know if it's a short video. I hope it wasn't like a dry, basic, boring video because I hate putting out BS content and I feel like content hasn't been as good because the last video wasn't too crazy because it was like more of me just talking about what happened with my car and this video was kind of ass too. I feel like personally. So uh, don't even trip, we're gonna get over this. Like I said, we got like a little car ride this next coming week. And yeah, um, so we definitely got some good content coming. So y'all gotta just bear with your boy for a second. My tires ain't as ball, so I know this ain't gonna be too bad of a drive, but even having a rural drive car, you're gonna hydroplane or it's a possibility, you know? So we're gonna get there and we're gonna just, you know, do the speed limit, probably under speed limit for real and just chill out, cruise and relax. All right, y'all, right, check this out. So we just came from Best Buy, got the uh, little MacBook charger that we needed. So we're gonna end this video off real quick and smooth. So if you have a like, comment or subscribe, yeah, go down and do that, you know what I'm saying? Help support the movement. If you like, comment and subscribe, turn on post notice so you won't miss a video from me. So it's eBay shot it, we out, we done, man. Uh, that ain't even my outro, but it's gonna have to wait hey, today. Yo, but I see y'all and I see y'all, y'all stay up, y'all stay positive. Let that shit ride, and we'll see y'all in a minute. I ain't into the cap and let's keep it real. He could have held us man down, he took a deal. That's why I can't show nobody how we live I got the news from my sister, gave me chills Gang off y'all pills, fucking up parties, it's just a thrill He popped his hands and I dog itching to do a drill